What is up, YouTube fam? It is Corey Ballmeister here, coming live for a, well, I guess it wouldn't be live if it's YouTube, huh? Whatever. Coming uh, to you with a modern super qualifier here. We're playing Sultai Reclamation. Um, this is a part of, you know, I don't, I don't want to say a new series I'm trying, but I want to try to do try hard tournaments that I don't necessarily want to stream just to post to YouTube and still talk through my plays and stuff like that. So it's going to be the road to Kaldheim uh, trying to qualify for that tournament. It's a lot of super qualifiers coming and we're just going to give it a shot. So let's do this. Okay, we're going to remove this so it's a better viewing experience. We'll go like this. Wish our opponent good luck and let's battle. Okay. So, should have the deck list below uh, for anybody wondering what we're playing here. Up against the Lurus Companion. So this could be Burn or anything. Regardless, there's a pretty solid hand against that. I do think we're on the draw here, though. Okay, yep, they're on the play, and they're mulliganing. Lurus, I, I can only really think of Burn. Oh, it could be Hammer Time. Could be Burner Hammer Time, probably. And Hammer Time has been a lot more popular. Yep. And this matchup is kind of scary. It's not my favorite. All right. We're just going to get the Triome. But we do, a, we do have a decent amount of interaction in this deck, so it's not the worst. When I have, like, the Omnath decks and stuff, I think it is uh, a much tougher matchup. Okay. Okay, we'll be killing that. This could just be some kind of, uh, um, you know, that deck that just plays all your cards, brings it back, and then uh, combos you off from there. I, I forgot what it's called, but could be that. All right, regardless, we have to kill this card. Hope they don't have another one. This will definitely tell us if it's hammer time or not. Okay. Stop. Hammer time. Ooh, that was good. That was good. Okay, so... Do you think we probably just want to kill this right away? Um. Yeah, so we're going to go like this. Blue, green... Uro. I actually think I want to get Watery Grave instead of playing this. This might look tempting, but I want to be able to escape Uro, and I would like to be able to um, get enough islands in place so that we can Sanctuary. So now the question is, do I want to do it now? Um... This isn't that important quite yet, and my spot removal is quite valuable, so I don't actually think we have to right now. Hmm. Yeah, I don't think so. Okay. So we're just gonna say go. We'll let them flash in whatever they want. The Stoneforge Mystic isn't a, a must kill right away kind of card um, like it is in most other matchups when they have Batter Skull. Okay. The beat downs, I'll take it. Okay. And returning Luris, okay. So now I think I can safely go get my Watery Grave. Mm -hmm. Okay, it's a good draw. So I think we probably just play this and say go, and then Factor Fiction plus Fatal Push something. Because we can even Factor Fiction while getting a Sanctuary here to put a removal spell on top and then escape Uro next turn. That seems nice. 
Um, so yeah, they're gonna get Paladin here though. That is kind of a problem. Not much I can do about that, except like killing this now, but that seems pretty loose. I will take it. <coughs> okay. Weird. With the mana to do it, you would think you would wanna do that, but okay. So let's just factor fiction and we'll see what we want to do with the land after that. Those are some good magical cards. Hmm. I don't think we really need the land. So I think I do kind of want these. More cards into my graveyard as well for Uro. I don't. Um, yeah, I don't want to use a removal spell yet. And I don't really care to get anything back yet because we have these two great removal spells so yeah we're just gonna get her oh i think interesting okay blue green blue green yeah this is gonna be great okay so let's get rid of the lands and the remand Uro. Yeah, don't really care about that. Um, snow. Field of the Dead time. More fields. And we'll say go. Now we can just Sanctuary back uh, Factor Fiction if we need, and then just go Reclamation and Fact. Don't think we care about that. We know they have one Hammer and Luris in hand, and whatever they search, plus one other Mystery card, Cranial Plating. Okay, so we know their hand is those three cards, and that's not bad. Um, sure. Okay. Um, I do think I want to kill this. And I do think I want factor fiction here. So I can go reclamation plus Uro. I guess we don't have to draw it yet. We can see what we draw. Okay. I think that was actually Dece. Um, So let's start with, well, if we want Factor Fiction, we should do it now. Which I think that is fine. I think we do want it. Okay, got tons of sanctuaries. Fact. Yes. Uro. Don't think we need this untapped. Okay. Factor fiction. Oh, whoops, I meant to do reclamation. Dang it. Dang it. That was stupid. Um, I guess I kind of want to land now. I don't believe I've played a land for turn. Yeah, we'll do this. That was silly. But that's okay. We'll make the best of a misclick. Still far ahead in this game. Absolutely crushing. Still 
think they should have played Laura so long ago. Like now we got it pretty locked up, but there was a there was a turn where it wasn't so great. Oh. Well, that's not great. Um Okay. It's all right. We got three blockers. And now four. Mystic Sanctuary. Let's get back another Factor Fiction. And I'll remand this. Play this land. We'll get on in there with these. We'll leave one back. That should be fine. I right, left two back. That's okay. Basically, just setting up uh, next turn lethal. Sure. Okay, so blue, blue, green, green. Let's bring back a row. It's pretty good. One, two, three, four, Wilderness Reclamation. Um, green, blue. I think we'll just play another Uro. Another one of these. All right, trigger on the stack. <clears throat> Blue, long tomb. On tap, <clears throat> factor fiction, and they're dead. <laughs> <coughs> if they give us a fact, we can fact again. And if we hit Nexus, we just win the game. Um, I think it's probably worth it. I don't know. Cryptic Command just locks it up, I think. Ah, yeah, we'll still do this. Seems like more fun. Fact. Nope, didn't get it. Now we get a Cryptic, though. And we say go. I think we can safely remand that. Jump block. Tap. They're really making us do it. I like it. All right. Tap drop. Game one to us in our battle to qualify for Cal time. Okay, so hammer time. Let's bring in more removal. Um, Gargaroth is probably not good enough. So I think that's all the cards we have. Uh, cards we don't want, probably Force. 
Although it is a good card at times. I don't think we need Life of the Loam. Remands are pretty bad too. Um, I think it's Force and Remands. Because Cryptics can be pretty good. So it's just which one's worse. What about that? That seems somewhat reasonable. On the draw, on the play, I think remands are better. So I think we'll have all remands in on the play, uh, but we'll try this on the draw. This hand is not good enough. A little too awkward. Pretty close, but no such luck. All right, this one's better. Get to get rid of uh, Nexus, which you almost never want in your opening hand. All right, let's do it. Okay. Well, we're gonna have to kill this regardless. So we might as well do it now. So that card just has to die. Um, actually, okay, there is a chance that we just go grow spiral next turn and fatal push it. So we'll do this now, maybe get our triome here. Yep, still think that's going to be our play. Slightly punishing. Let's go like this. Green... Green, blue, grow spiral. Go like this, Blood Chief's Thirst. This one. Uh-oh. Okay, so I guess we're just dead unless we get something good. How about a damnation? Damnation! Okay. Yeah, I think we're just dead. Uro. Man, the double giver was brutal. Okay, well. Guess we get to try to fatal push during their upkeep to see if we get to kill their thing. Otherwise, we are dead. If they figure out how their cards work, then we lose. All right. Now, I think remands are still better, like we were saying on the play, instead of these. Um, but yeah, that was uh, gross. That was gross. All right, let's try again. All right, 01 is a death sentence in these large events, so let's try not to lose. Ugh. 
This is a bit of a loose goose. But I mean, Cryptic is super powerful and we're on the play. Could just do a Cryptic loop. I mean, how do they even beat a Cryptic loop? And then if we top deck any Growth Spiral or Interaction, I think this hand is insane. I'm gonna try it. This easily could just be a, a loose goose, lose keep. But if the top of our deck is nice to us, then we're set. And if it's somewhat nice to us, then we should be fine. But we could also die before we cast any spells. And yeah, like a Reclamation would be insane. Just really get stuff going there. So we'll start with our Triome. Sick. That was absolutely sick. That was just about perfect. Gross Pyro would have been a little better, I think, but this is about the second best. Yep, yeah, no thank you. Remand. Oh, there it is. Okay, so. I think I do it now to start. Hmm. Don't think I'm gonna want remand back, so I don't think I wanna fetch land. So let's go like this, and I think we just put an overgrown tomb into play tapped. It kind of gives away our weakness this turn, but that's okay. Mm-hmm. Push would have been insane. Could try to just fact to try to find something, but then that leads a foul of us just being dead. Um, we could just bounce draw a card. Hmm. We are just gonna say go. We know they have hammer, but that is it. I think, we're, I think our plan is just counter bounce if they do something here. Just to be safe. Okay, so they're trying to get another hammer. Could counter bounce. And then they just replay Pal Paladin. That's not bad. Counterbounce. So 
Since we have another cryptic, I don't think I have to search for a sanctuary yet. Okay, that was pretty interesting. Um, green, blue, grow spiral. Okay, let's go like this. Let's play this. Now let's say go. Can just do it again. Then they can replay Paladin and hammer it up. We could, no, yeah, all right. I think we have to just do it again. Come bounce. Yep. And here's the hammer. So now I think we sanctuary for a cryptic and then just go factor fiction plus cryptic backup. And we get to factor fiction first, which is nice. So let's get cryptic. Anything but like an ink moth. I just don't want another threat. Okay, perfect. Knew we were drawing that. Um, yeah, we start with fact. Perfect. Yeah, I'll be taking that top. <laughs> I'll be taking that top. Okay. Um, yeah, seems amazing. Okay, um, yeah, I think we just kill it now. Then we say go. Don't think we need the sanctuary for anything because I think we just want to Uro next turn. Okay, that's pretty good. Yep. Now we just counter that. Should have this one pretty locked up. Hmm. It's pretty spice. Blue, blue, green, green, a row. Everybody's favorite Titan coming to play. And we'll say go. Then I think we just get a sanctuary into play, put cryptic on top, and then counter draw. Sanctuary, cryptic on top. Well, this hand developed quite well from our opener. Counter draw. Okay. That's a good blocker. 
Alrighty, well, I need another fetch land if I want to do anything about this. I could bounce draw. It's not bad. Yeah, I, I... Yeah, I think that seems perfectly fine. Bounce draw. Okay, um, now we just can go get the other sanctuary and put another cryptic back on top if we want. I don't think we need to. I think double remand is probably better. Now we can remand plus fact. A remand. Mm. A remand. Yay! We did it! GG 101010. Oh, oh, oh. All right, stay tuned for round number two.